Hello, it's Ron back here uh, from Ron Brown's YouTube channel where we discuss a lot of drones, drone gear, drone tech, action cameras, and also pocket cameras. Um, and today we've got another update on the DJI Pocket 3, the hottest new uh, gadget on the, uh, on the tubes here. Um, they're blowing up. Igor, my buddy Igor over at Quattro News, he's blowing up Twitter, X, whatever you want to call it, with all the new leaks and rumors and so on. And we have been waiting. We we know that we know the date, um, which is like the uh, this Wednesday. Yeah, the date, uh, the release date is the twenty fifth, uh, October twenty fifth, and we know a lot of specs. We've discussed this in previous Pocket Three videos on the channel, so I won't go over that again. But what we found out last night or overnight, again, this is the twenty first, me. So in the AM hours for me on the east coast of the U.S. Uh, 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 you know, Eagle released the pricing. Now, uh, for the Pocket 3, just the base kit, which uh, it means you don't get, uh, I mean, you get the camera, um, you know, a couple things. Uh, just, just the base kit. You don't get the microphone and all the other doodads or whatever. Uh, he has the pricing at 531 and he has the Pocket 3 combo at 676 where you kind of get everything you need. So, um, yeah, I, I guess, you know, I don't know if these are in U.S. dollars. I never kind of understand, um, you know, when they release the pricing, the world pricing per se. Uh, these were very well could be the U.S. prices. I don't know that. You, usually when they leak prices for these, like, I'll say drones in most cases, usually the prices are lower in the U.S. than what they're quoting you, um, you know, uh, for whatever these world prices, any any market, but here. So um, I'm not going to say that 531 is going to be the exact price of the Pocket 3 when it comes out next Wednesday in the U.S. But maybe it's a ballpark price. Maybe that means it's going to be like 4.99. Uh, you know, ho hopefully lower than that. Um, if these prices indeed are the real going to be the real U.S. prices. Uh, 531, 676. That's going to be a little bit of a sticker shock. I, I believe the most folks who who purchased their Pocket 2 for 349 and their uh, you know Pocket uh, Osmo Pocket 2 combo for 499. Again, these are uh, major uh, price hikes here. Um, you know, I don't even want to come up with a percent here, but uh, you know they're they're a, a, a giant percent upgrade from the previous pricing. So um, let's hope these prices are you know, um, in some other currency, converted from some of the currency where they're going to be much lower than that. But what I'm afraid is, you know, uh, I don't know how much lower. If they're quoting 531, uh, you know, I, I, I was hoping it would come in between 339 and 449 for the pocket three. And somewhere in the 499 to say 599 for the combo. So, um, yeah, I, I, these, you know, uh, this doesn't sound good right here. That's all I can say is, ho and, and hopefully they'll be lower, because uh, I think it'll definitely uh, slow down the, um, you know, the rollout of this thing. I mean, I know there's people with pen up waiting to get this pocket three. They're going to order it no matter what the pricing is. But that's 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 you know, that's a small group. Bro. They're a loud group. You know, you hear a lot from them when comments and so on, so that's great. But I, I, I think a lot of uh, other people are going to balk at this pricing and maybe just go with a uh, Action 4 or a Hero 12 or something like that in, instead or Insta360 Prod. Just my opinion, maybe maybe this is a, a completely fair price for what you're getting here. Maybe most people are going to be willing to pay these prices. Again, this is just my opinion. So, um, yeah, so that, that's kind of it on the pricing for right now. If I know any more details, you know, I'll come back. I kind of I kind of heard the pricing was going to be lower than this from uh, a leak that, uh, you know, from a leak I have. So, um, again, hopefully these prices are a little bit high here. And one other thing I want to go over here. Um, we talked about specs before, and I made a video where I kind of, um, you know, just a little conjecture here of, uh, you know, possibly what this what the specs could be on things that weren't mentioned on the side of the box type thing. And uh, here, here for again, this is from Igor here. He has a, that the, you know, the focal uh, equivalent of the lens will be 20 millimeter. So that's, that's pretty wide. 20 meters is pretty wide. I mean, you know, um, not super duper, you know, um, action camera wide, but, but that's 20 millimeters is pretty wide. He has an aperture in this thing of F2.0. Which is kind of a, you know unusual. I don't think we've been getting, 
you know, F, uh, the, the F2.0 aperture on many of these devices, usually it's 2.8 or it goes all the way down to like a 1.7 or something like that. So uh, anyhow, a, a 2.0 aperture on a uh, one sensor is a pretty exciting prospect uh, as far as for low light and nighttime shooting. Uh, that has some, you know, uh, possibilities. And the focus ranges from, uh, um, you know, 0.2 meters to 8 uh, so um, that sounds like it can, uh, you know, focus in pretty close on things. Um, I don't know how that compares to the previous pocket, but um, you know, and it looks like it has a, you know, the photos are going to be like 3840 by 2160. So this is kind of 4K photos, and it uh, looks like this will have a digital zoom on it, which I think the other one had a digital zoom. Um, the shutter will be up for photos and video. The shutter will be able to go as high as, you know, 1 over 8,000 for the shutter. So uh, that's pretty good. We knew about the one in sensor. I'm trying to go over the things here. Um, touch screen is 2 point inch, two, you know, two inches. I don't know if we knew that. The, the uh, brightness will be 700 nits. So that will be the equivalent of, like, the, the DJI uh, RC2 or any of the DJI controllers with a built-in screen. So uh, support up the... SD card is up to 512. I don't know what the support was on the um, previous model. Uh, here's a good thing. It says you could charge the battery up to 80% in only 16 minutes. So it sounds like it has some of the fast charging capabilities that the um, Action 4 has. And it takes you 32 minutes to charge the battery up to 100%. So that sounds pretty darn good. Uh, and they're basing that on the DJI 65 watt PD charger, which of course is sold separately. You no longer get a, uh, a power brick from DJI, I think, in any of their consumer consumer products. So, uh, yeah. And um, the image resolution at 60.9 is 3840 by 2160, which is 4K. And at one, one by one is 30, uh, 3072 by 3072. So, a little bit less than 4K there. So, okay, that's just some of the... Um, you know, the latest updates uh, Igor put out last night, but some important ones, that uh, pricing, you know, it's, it's, it's important. I don't know if it's the pricing you wanted. Uh, and then some of these specs uh, that we have here, some more full feature specs. A lot of good news there for me anyways, that 2.0 aperture on a wanted sensor. Pretty exciting news. And uh, the, the field of view sounds pretty good. I mean, the, the first pocket had, um, you know, it... Uh, uh, you know, I don't know what the field of view of that, but it, it was too narrow for most people. Most people wanted a wider one. So in the second pocket, they included included a wide-angle lens. You know, I don't know if that just came in the combo, if that came out with the, the regular drone, uh, I mean the regular uh, pocket. And I, and I think it also had a wider field of view even without using that wide-angle lens. But, I mean, it sounds like this is going to be... You know, wide enough to do vlogging, in other words, here. A lot of people want to vlog. They just don't want themselves in the shot. They want to, you know, they want a, a lot of the background and what they're seeing in without having to hold it, you know, like having, you know, on a kind of pole, hold it a long way from them. So, yeah, a lot of good news here. Okay, I'm going to wrap up this, you know, short, like, video here. So, just wanted to get that out there. And if I, oh, oh, one, one, last, uh, one last note here. A lot of people uh, think that a new DJI mic is coming out Wednesday as well. Uh, and that's based on a, a, a new a wireless mic hitting the FCC database uh, last week. Uh, I don't know if that's, a, what I'm holding here is a DJI mic, uh, the kit, you know, the original one with the, you know, everything in a little charging box. I don't know if it's meant as a replacement for this or there's a brand new product, um, you know, beyond this or, it, you know, that sits side by side in line with this. We don't really know details, but if I find out more, I will come back, uh, you know, uh, uh, with a video. So, um, yeah, that's it for today, and we'll, we'll, you know, I hope you enjoyed it, and we'll see you in the next one, folks.